Hey, good morning, it's Mr. Brown. Today I'm gonna to go over how we're gonna make our phone stand right here uh, in Inventor. So what we're gonna do is we're going to... All right, so I've got this little technical drawing right here. This is what we're going to make in Inventor or whatever program we're using. Right now we're using Inventor. So this is kind of, has all the dimensions and everything that we need. What we're going to do is we're going to take our drawing, we're going to take it over to the laser. If you want, you can add a cute little picture there if you want to. From there, we're going to cut it all out. So here's the two separate pieces, and the way it works is that this gets cut apart like this, and then these two pieces will end up going together like that, and so you get a nice little stand right there like that okay. so what we're going to do is we're going to make this as a technical drawing so in the computer you're going to open up autodesk inventor however we're doing that so follow the directions how to open inventor either on the laptop or the desktop computers and then once we are there in inventor we're going to create a new drawing so i'm going to so this is the uh, opening screen of Inventor 2024. You won't have all this stuff here. This is just all your recent files, things you've opened up. So I'm going to come over here. I'm going to click New. And then the next screen that pops up looks like this. It tells me I can create a new part, an assembly, a drawing, or a presentation. So just real quick, a part is like if I have... If I have one thing, that is a part. You can make this as a part. If I take multiple parts and I put them together, now I have an assembly. So this is an example of an assembly, and then something like this is an example of a drawing. Uh, we won't get into the presentations in this class, but if you wanted to make like a really cool looking presentation, little animation thing of whatever it is you make, that's how you do that. So we're gonna make a drawing file in Inventor. All right. So first thing is we need to know what units we are working in. And it is a lot easier to choose this now than to figure it out later. So up here where it says templates, this little en-us, English US, hit the little down arrow. English if you want to work in inches, metric if you want to work in millimeters. For this assignment, let's work in inches. And we're going to create a drawing. So we're going to click on this ANSI inches.idw. So we're going to click on that and we're going to hit create. This will open up a nice blank drawing canvas for us to work in. 